Sheikh, um, forgive me for asking a question that was asked, uh, I think, a few weeks ago. I saw it on one of your clips. Mm -hmm. um, I just would like some further clarification, please. Um, it, it's with regards to um, not feeding uh, non-Muslims during the month of Ramadan. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, my, my, um, my extended family are non-Muslims. And um, it, it happens that when I, for example, visit my uh, grandmother, elderly grandmother, um, if I'm sort of taking care of her, um, I may have to feed her as part of my duty with her. Um, so my first question is, if... She's 98, so mashallah, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide her to Islam. I mean, I mean, I mean um, if, if, uh, if I had to feed her, uh, um, is this acceptable or not? Yes, it is definitely is acceptable. Yes, it is definitely acceptable. And may Allah bless you for that. Yes. And you will definitely be rewarded a great deal for that. Remember, if she was Muslim and she is 80 plus or 90 plus, not able to fast, she's exempt. So now she is not Muslim and she is 90 plus. Go ahead and feed her and give her the medication and the drink and assume a, a huge word from the Almighty Allah. I mean, and to shake another question as well then. Um, usually when I visit my grandmother, uh, my mother is sort of with her and I often take something with me for the family. Um, is this classified as feeding them? For example, if I take fruits or a cake or something no, like that? No, no, so it is would, not. This would be... No, it is not. Feeding them is preparing lunch and having them eat. But taking dessert, taking sweet, chocolate, milk, fruits, you know, like you're going to visit your family and you're taking gifts with you, you are definitely rewarded for that. You will be rewarded for upholding okay, the I'm ties. Not... You will be rewarded for upholding the ties of your kinship, even though they are not Muslims. Visiting your mother and your grandmother, this is an act of worship, even though they are not Muslims. Buying gifts for them, including food, you will be rewarded. And this is an act of charity from you, and you will be rewarded for that, despite the fact they are not Muslims. What is not permissible is fixing food for somebody who is capable to fast, and they are not fasting, even if they are not Muslims. You don't feed neither a Muslim who is capable to fast and doesn't have an excuse, nor a non-Muslim during the day time of Ramadan. Just one further clarification then as well. So if I'm visiting somebody in hospital, again a non-Muslim, this would be the same. If I bring something to them, Absolutely. Um, they, it's, that's, not, that's, that's acceptable. Yes. Absolutely, no problem. Okay. Shukran, okay. Um, Muhammad, wafikum barak, and I appreciate your calling in and asking these questions concerning your family.